What's up guys, it's Drax here. Today I'm going to show you on how to make this Black Joggers logo merged rip shirt outfit that you do see in the thumbnail. So for the first part, I'm going to show you on how to get the Black Joggers and to do this, you're going to pull up your interaction menu, go to services, go to mobile operations center and request your MOC. After you do request your MOC, you're just going to wait for it to spawn on the map. Mine will spawn right here. So once your MOC does spawn in on the map, you're then just going to head to the back of your MOC. After you do get inside your MOC, you're going to want to go ahead and go to the jobs inside your MOC. So it's going to say access mobile operations. After you are here, go ahead and hit run on the D-pad, log in, and scroll down to the bottom. And we're going to be using the work dispute so we can get the black joggers. So just go ahead and launch this job. And after you do launch this job, you guys will need a friend to help you out. And after you guys have a friend loaded in that can help you out, you can just go ahead and start the job. And for the difficulty, make sure you do set it to easy so then you guys do have more lives. But I'll just get back to you whenever I do load into the job. Once you load into the job, if you guys are the first player, which is the host, you guys will begin the black joggers. But if you're the second player, you're going to be getting the red joggers. Whenever you guys fully load in, just go ahead and head to your apartment. When you do get to your apartment, just letting you guys know, if you guys are new to this, you guys cannot see your apartment on the map, so you will have to remember where your apartment is at. So whenever you are at your apartment, go ahead and walk up to the blue circle, and you're going to want to go ahead and blow yourself up. You can use a rocket or a sticky bomb. So whenever, once you're in the blue circle, just blow yourself up. And after you do load back into the session, go ahead and just walk into your apartment. Whenever you're here inside your apartment, go ahead and go down to the changing clothes section. Whenever you're here inside the closet, just go ahead and scroll down to your accessories and you're just going to want to change one part of your outfit. So just change the gloves or you can change the shoes. But since I'm just going to go ahead and change the shoes, head to your accessories, scroll down to gloves, and you can just put on any pair of gloves that you guys want. After you do equip the gloves that you guys do like with the, with the outfit, it really doesn't matter. But just go ahead and save this outfit on any slot. After you do save the outfit, you can now back up, back out of the closet. Go ahead and you can now pull up your phone and just leave the job from your phone. When you do load back into a public session with the black joggers, you can go ahead and head to the clothing store so we can go ahead and do the outfit that you guys see in the thumbnail. After you do make it to the clothing store and you have the black joggers, you're now going to walk over here to the top section, scroll down until you do find designer t-shirts on slot 34 and you're gonna look for the, the VDG skeleton t-shirt, which will be near the top on slot 13. After you do buy the VDG skeleton t-shirt, you can then just back out of the top. Now you're gonna scroll back down until you find tank tops on slot 49 and look for the black tank or it's gonna be the black no retreat tank on slot 16. Now you're gonna go ahead and buy and equip this tank top. After you do that, you're then just gonna back out of the top section we don't need to worry about the pants since we do have the black joggers, but go over here to your accessories and then you're going to go to scarves on slot three and equip the black desert scarf on slot two. After you do equip the scarf, now go to gloves on slot seven and look for the black woolen gloves on slot 58. After you have the black woolen gloves, you can then go to cuffs on slot eight and you're going to equip the spiked gauntlet for your left arm, which will be on slot 27. Now, if you scroll down to, I believe it's going to be slot 71, you're going to equip the spiked gauntlet for your right arm. When your character has the scarf, the gloves, and the cuffs, that's all for your accessories. Now, you can walk over here to your shoes, go to skate shoes on slot 3, and equip the all black skate shoes on slot 16. And after you do have these skate shoes, back out of the shoe section, and now we're going to do the logo merge glitch. All you need to do is just head to your apartment. Whenever you do make it to your apartment, go into the changing clothes area or your closet, and then you're going to go to the top section and scroll down until you do find designer t-shirts. Designer t-shirts for me is on slot 38. It might be on a different slot for you, but click on designer t-shirts and you're going to look for the VDG skeleton t-shirt. So once you do find the skeleton t-shirt, you're now just going to hover over it. Don't click on it, but once you are hovering over the skeleton t-shirt, you're now going to hit pause. You can either join off of one of your friends if you have a friend online. If you don't, what I normally do is just go to online, go to cruise. You can join off of one of your crew members or 
you can go to suggested crews, friends crews, invitations, or maybe the request. What I normally do is just go to leaderboard. I go to the IGN crew. I view members and just find somebody from there because there is somebody always online. Once you do find somebody that you can join off of, you're just going to join their session. So that one failed. We're going to try to find somebody else. And once we do find somebody, we're just going to try to join their lobby. And you should see that the logo merges over to the tank top. And just like that, after you load into a brand new lobby, you should see that the skeleton logo merges over to the tank top. Now, all we're gonna do is head back to the clothing store. After you make it back to the clothing store, you're then gonna go over here to the top section, go to utility vest on slot 60, and you're gonna scroll down to slot 43 or 44, which should be the peach plate carrier. And after you do equip the peach plate carrier, you should see that the skeleton is still on the tank top. You can then just back out of the top section and now we're gonna go up here to the front counter. Your outfit should look exactly like mine. When your outfit looks like this, hit edit saved outfits and save your outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save your outfit, back out of the edit saved outfits, scroll down through your clothing until you find heist coveralls on slot 13. Scroll down from slot nine through slot 12 and equip one of these outfits with the toxic mask. After you do that, back out of the front counter and now we're gonna head over here to the pier for the telescope glitch. Once you do find a telescope on the pier, just do the telescope glitch. So run by the telescope like this, press right on the D-pad, you'll see that your character runs in place, then look towards the telescope, that's how you know you're glitched. Pull up your interaction menu, go to style, and equip the outfit you saved at the clothing store, which will look like this. Put away your interaction menu, walk away from the telescope, the mask will merge over with your outfit. All we're gonna do now is just head to a gun store. When you are at the gun store, just walk over here to the top section and then you can hit edit saved outfits and save your outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save your outfit, back out of the top section and now we're going to start up a job. To do this, hit pause, go to online, click on jobs, click on play job, click on rockstar created, click on missions, look for the job that's called a titan of a job and fully start up that mission. And after you load into the job, you should see that the peach plate carrier is gone but you're still wearing the toxic mask. Now go back over here to the tops, hit edit saved outfits, and once again, save your outfit on any slot that you want. After you do save your outfit, back out of the top section. Now we're gonna pull up our phone and just quit the job from our phone. So guys, after you load back into a public or an invite only lobby, you're gonna run back inside the gun store, go over here to the top section. You're gonna go to vest on slot 54, and don't equip a sweater vest that looks like this, just equip any normal vest that looks like this. After you equip a normal vest, back out of vest, go to vest shirts on slot 55, and this is the one that's important, you're gonna equip the black band vest shirt on slot 14, this will give you the black sleeves. After you do equip the black band vest shirt, back out of the top section, now we're gonna do the merge glitch. So I will leave a link in the description for it's a G thing, you guys can bookmark that job for the merge glitch, but for me, I'm gonna do the heist apartment merge, so I will get back to you when I am in my apartment. After you have made it to your apartment, you're going to go into the heist planning board room and go up here to the heist planning board. Out of all the five heists, you're going to select the first one, which is called Fleek a Job. After you do select the Fleek a Job, complete the first mission, which is called Scope Out, and then go to the second job, which is called Kuruma, and just launch that mission. When you have loaded into the Kuruma job, set your heist clothing to player saved outfits, and then you can confirm your settings and invite whoever you want, like a friend or a random, and when someone does join, just launch the job. Now that you're in here where it shows your owned outfits, scroll to the slot to wherever you did save the outfit, which will look just like this, and you can hit ready to play. All you need to do now is whenever you load into the Kuruma job is just pull up your phone. So we're going to wait for it to let me pull up my phone and then just quit the job from your phone. Once you have loaded back into a public or an invite only lobby, you're going to find a car. It doesn't matter if it's your personal vehicle or a random civilian car on the street, go ahead and get inside that car. Now pull up your interaction menu and register as a boss. So you can register as a CEO or a motorcycle club. After you do that, pull up your interaction menu up again, click on secure serve CEO or motorcycle club, then go to management, go to style and on your CEO style or MC style, scroll one time to the left, then one time to the right back to none. Now hop out of the car and then you should see that you guys get the ripped tank top shirt with the black band vest shirt with the rest of your outfit, just like this. All we're gonna do now is just go back to the clothing store so we can get a few accessories. After you have made it back to the clothing store, walk over here to the hat section, scroll down until you find the bulletproof helmets on slot 19 and go down to the bottom and buy the black bulletproof. After you buy the black bulletproof helmet, back out of the hat section, Go over here to your glasses, and then you go to gun range glasses, and scroll down until you find the orange guns on slot 11. 
after you do equip the orange guns back out of the glasses what we're going to do now is get the mask so just head over here to the mask door once you're at the mask door you can walk over here to your mask scroll down to ski mask on slot 21 and you're going to look for the black toggle ski which will be right up here or the charcoal toggle ski on slot 94. after you do equip the charcoal toggle ski your hat and your or your bulletproof helmet and your glasses will come off now we're going to head over here to the pier to do the telescope glitch so then we can merge the helmet and the glasses with the mask okay guys after you find a telescope on the pier you're just going to do the telescope glitch so run by the telescope like this you hit right on the d-pad you'll see that your character runs in place then look towards the telescope that's how you know you're glitched pull up your interaction menu go to style go to your accessories and you're going to scroll through your helmets until you find the black bulletproof your mask will come off you guys don't need to worry after you find the black bulletproof helmet put away your interaction menu walk away from the telescope and the helmet and the mask will merge together like this now we're going to get the glasses to do this just do the mask glitch again or the telescope glitch run by the telescope press right on the d-pad just like last time your character will run in place look towards the telescope now pull up your interaction menu go to style go to your accessories and just scroll through your glasses until you find the orange guns so your mask will come off but you guys don't need to worry after you do find the orange guns just put away your interaction menu walk away from the telescope and your mask the glasses and the helmet will merge together like this and that's all for your outfit so this is what your outfit will look like whenever you're done if you were wondering what it looks like in the pause menu here you guys go that will be all so if you just want to save it go to the clothing store you can save it on whichever slot you want and that will be all i hope you guys did enjoy this black joggers rip shirt outfit for your male character please like and subscribe thank you guys for watching peace